and what is trending. I think it's just a lot of the same stuff and it's getting really boring. I'd love to see more diversity at play. I'd like for like creators on the rise to have a bigger, a bigger spot platform. Like I wish there was like 10 creators on the rise. You know, I think that'd be great. I'd love for more women, obviously as a women of YouTube podcast hostess that you were all here together to do. I want more women to have stand out. I want there to be more pay. I want the, I want at this very point right now, social media is so fucking diverse. I mean, you got black men, black male creators, black female creators, gay, lesbian, pansexual, bisexual, binary. Twitch has a Twitch has a category for neurodivergent for um binary but LGBTQIA plus categories for streamers. You have people, <laughs> you got categories for asexual. Like you have all, YouTube is its own big search engine. Yeah, yes, definitely ran it. Like social media has all these different places where people can be amongst people like them for whatever reason they have to be amongst their people. And still people believe that it needs to be more diverse. People believe you can go. There are channels dedicated to female creators, but it's still not enough for people. They need more, <laughs> more, they need more diversity. It's not only by name, but it's pretty much morphed into one. Yes, it has. They need more diversity. There's people that still complain about not seeing female creators in, on certain channel, female creators highlighted on certain platforms. They have whole months out of the year on social media, on these platforms dedicated to female creators. And it's not enough. You as a content creator, you're that's another reason why people are leaving youtube right because people just want to be focused on making content they don't want to be focused on diversity things they just want to make content they want to watch content that they like they don't want to be told that they should be liking the content because of the person is a, of a protected class right people are just focused on the content they just want to be focused on the content let me explain something to you Okay, let me just let me just let me just explain something to you. Diversity on social media is used to put you in a in a category of people so that you can be further manipulated and and and, and, and things can and your emotional triggers can be pulled. That's what happens when 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 people mention diversity, okay? Diversity is not a benefit to you, it is a crutch. It is used against you to control you on social media and in platforms. <laughs> okay. Diversity and talking about diversity is not to your benefit. It is to your detriment. Okay. Nick said, man, folks, you Nick, I started talking about diversity and it was boop, 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 boop. And people started bouncing. Look here, let me explain something to you again. All right. A lot of creators and the creative spaces, they're comfortable with a lot of pandering when you start mentioning female creators and they get mad. And, you know, I had people ask me, how come I don't watch female creators and all this other nonsense? Listen, we don't pander to female creators. We treat people as equals. That's what that means. I talk to a lot of female creators all the time. Rain and woman is a female creator in my platform. I talk to rain and woman all the time. I help female creators all the time. I They can hit me in my Twitter DMs and ask me a question and I can help them. Johnny on the spot. Boom, boom, bang, boom. This is how you do it. Thank you, Siova. We ha I have a good functional working relationship with female creators, but I treat people as equal. And that's what you should have. That's what you should want to treat creators as equal, not by, by their gender or their sexual identity, but simply by the person that they are. So when you so when these people when they come online and they talk about they don't they don't see enough women you don't see enough women because they're talented or you don't see enough women because you you just don't you want to see more women 
because you can there's female content creators on the platform right hundred thousand two hundred thousand fifty thousand forty thousand thirty thousand twenty thousand a million two million eight million ten million twenty million like what are we talking about when you talk about diversity on social media, diversity on these platforms, what are we really talking about? Because I follow, I watch female content creators when they're talking about certain things. It may not just be tech. It may not be music. It may be something else. How can they ask for equality and 10 seconds later ask why you don't watch women's? Listen. <laughs> Listen, okay, listen, okay, I don't know, I can't, I don't know how to answer that, I can't tell you, I don't know, all right, I don't know, but when people, when people beg and, and scream and, and screech for diversity, not because the platform needs diversity but because they just want to see it right there are people who just say like for mr beast why don't he have women in his videos <laughs> what <laughs> what they need to be more female creators on what it has nothing to do with them actually being good or, or of quality or able to compete it just has to do with them just being women and and that's a and that's a problem and that problem is why people are moving off of these big tech platforms it's not because um you know of the patriarchy and the misogyny it's because they don't want to be dictated to to what people they include and what they and what they should watch and what they watch right like yeah nick i've had people like I've I've had people I was going on a list telling people about tech content creators and all the tech people that she watch and a person asked me how come I don't have any women on the list I'm like I don't that's not something I was thinking about when I when I was showing you guys what I'm talking about right <laughs> that's, that's not that that's not a thing right that's not that's not something I'm thinking about. People think about diversity instead of thinking about the message and thinking about the content. They just want to see something. They want to see to please, not see to learn and see to be informed and see to appreciate. If you have a creator on the rise, appreciate the person. Don't say they see the creator on the rise and say, how come there's not a woman in the video? <laughs> how come there's not a woman on that, on that list? That. <laughs> 